I was like everybody else. I'm like, I can only watch with one eye. It's kind of a train wreck, you know? You, you watch um, just out of curiosity, but I certainly didn't appreciate it. Uh, we enjoyed the fights, but we sat there and we said, gosh, you know, are we really that different than everybody else that we actually like this and nobody else cares? Or is something not right here? Could something be done better? Better meant getting UFC events back on cable, but that required approval from the Nevada State Athletic Commission. We went out there and it looked like we had the votes. We were told we did. And about midnight, I got a phone call that one of the commissioners had changed his mind. And that commissioner was? It, it turns out that commissioner was Lorenzo Fertitta, that he had changed his mind and that we wouldn't be able to get approval. For Myrowitz, Lorenzo Fertitta's vote spelled doom, but the UFC would soon get a second lease on life. I got a call from, well, actually from Dana White. And Dana White said, I have somebody who wants to buy this. You'll never guess who. And you had no idea who? I said, give me one guess. Lorenzo Fertitta. He said, how did you guess? I said, call me lucky. I think he was a bit surprised when we said we'd like to buy the whole thing. But ultimately, you know, he decided that it was the right time to pass on and, and move on. I was like everybody else. I'm like, I can only watch with one eye. It's kind of a train wreck, you know? You, you watch um, just out of curiosity, but I certainly didn't appreciate it. Uh, we enjoyed the fights, but we sat there and we said, gosh, you know, are we really that different than everybody else that we actually like this and nobody else cares? Or is something not right here? Could something be done better? I got a call from, well, actually from Dana White. And Dana White said, I have somebody who wants to buy this. And it, it just had reached a point where I really didn't want to do this anymore. Dana came to me and said that he had heard that the owner at the time was looking to sell the business or that the business was going to trade. He said, you should give Bob a call. I cold called him. They named a price. We did a deal. It was just as simple as that. Just as simple as that. I think he was a bit surprised when we said we'd like to buy the whole thing, but ultimately, you know, he decided that it was the right time to pass on and, and move on.